for Sims in Bloom. If you have seen the recent episode, then you'll know that Emily and Dawn are now moved out. They have moved on their own into an apartment. Primrose is no more. Uh, she's not dead, but she is uh, now no longer living with the girls. So um, they have moved, I believe, into the fashion district now. Um, so a whole new neighborhood in San Maishuno, but they do need to live in an apartment. Uh, well, Thorn at least needs to live in an apartment throughout her whole adult life. So um, this is where we are. We're in 701 Zen View. And I think I am going to... Oh my God, it removes like everything. <gasps> okay, this is kind of cool actually. We've got a lot to work with. Let's piece back the apartment together. Okay. Okay, so this is the space that we've got. We could do like an open plan kind of vibes here. Or we could... Actually, no, because then that's extra space. Um, uh, you've got your char leader in your corner. Thank you. That's so cute. My cheerleader, my char leader. Oh, thank you, Moira. I'm so glad. I'm glad that you enjoy the streams. I'm glad I can hang out with you while you're studying and whatnot as well. That's awesome. Yeah, I love the fact it's got a balcony. I'm thinking, do you not think we should like make this a room as well rather than have it as the open space? Yeah, I think we should. So otherwise, we're not going to even be able to put, like, um, what do you call it? Like, lights or anything that are, are there. So I think we will do this. And then we will have stairs leading up, maybe. Um, glad you clarified that Prim's not dead. Exactly. Uh, I would knock down the kitchen wall. Oh, we, we've knocked down everything, Tibble. <laughs> We've, uh, I'm starting it, like, I, I'm, I'm building the apartment kind of thing, so I'm not using whatever came with the game. We're just going all out, like, doing it how we want to build it. Um, so, yeah, we're all good. Right, I'm going to do the stairs there and have that like that. And then I think this is going to be, like, a general, maybe, hallway kind of vibes. Um, we do need some light in here, although this can be... Hmm... That's really annoying that it's doing that. Can that go like that? So it's a room. Okay, that will do. Okay, that's fine. Um, let's see. My Simpson Bloom family uh, is in the apartment next to yours. Love that then. It's a nice little close connection. Hello, Molly. Happy Tuesday. Thank you so much for lurking while you work. And Mia, thank you for that lurk too. And Demon, thank you for the lurk. Good morning, Ari. Good morning, good morning. Good afternoon from England. Um, loft type thing for the master bedroom? Or the main bedroom even? Yeah, we... I think one of... We'll have a room for the girlies. And I think we will have a, a second bedroom up here as well. I think I'm going to do like that. This could even be three bedroom, I'm not going to lie. Like, we could do bedroom there. Um, like, maybe another bedroom there, and then bathroom, and then, like, main bedroom. That's what I'm thinking. Unless... Unless we do... Let's say... Um, the only thing I think is it's on a quake zone. Wait, really? So you get the shakes every now and then? Wait, for real? How do you know that, Nika? Um, and Raccoon. Can we get some hype and flex in chat for um, Raccoon there with the 28 months? That is a big, big flex. Thank you so, so much for that support. Thank you for the last 28 months of subscribing. Thank you for being here, being a part of this wonderful community um, and choosing to sub for 28 whole months. That is a long, long time. A big happy Tuesday to you as well, Raccoon. Thank you for everything over the last 28 months. And I hope that you're doing well. I hope you're having a lovely week so far far um and a good tuesday thank you so so much for that um big big hypes in chat for raccoon everybody oh little sweetheart yeah i'm thinking that one of the bedrooms actually i think i like that what i've just done maybe um we do this sort of vibe like 
so these are two bedrooms this will be a bathroom this is going to be like thorn's dream room and then this will be their main bedroom i'm thinking maybe we even could do that a little bit bigger have it a bit of a different shape um yeah then this is actually really spacious you know i'm loving this okay cool let's do that and then i'm gonna do this kind of want to do like a hallway vibe but let's see lilac teddy hello welcome in welcome welcome um it might be the apartment next to it but yeah it has if it has the quake zone lot challenge it shakes every now and then oh how do i know oh quake zone okay we seem to be good are there any that like we could add imagine adding wild foxes they just show up um okay no the quake zone is probably gonna like be a bit triggering uh the exit to the balcony is okay well um, unless we do unless we swap these round and make that the main bedroom possibly and then have this as a bathroom. Just do a little swap -sies. Could do that. Wait a minute. Wait, go back. I don't know what I'm doing with that. Um, yeah, I think maybe we, unless we do that. Wait a second, push that. Okay, confusion. If we do... Bedroom, bedroom. Ah! Um, okay. thinking uh i really think adding the volcano would be amazing i love how you noticed that zoe i was like hovering over that like do i <laughs> would it be so weird if i added this volcanic activity to this <laughs> um okay um so we well the beginning of this wasn't uh in this episode it was the beginning of this was in the last Sims and Bloom episode, which I actually haven't edited. Um, so you're all good, Raven. It's, um, we are moving to, I don't know if it's a penthouse. It's just another apartment in the fashion district. Um, but is it classified as a penthouse? I have no idea. Okay, what I'm going to do, this is going to be bathroom. This is going to be, unless, no, we'll do this. This is the stream room separate to kind of everything and it will be locked only for thorn okay and then down here we kind of don't need more than one bathroom so do i want to do that i don't know what i want to do with this hmm how do I want to do this? No, maybe I will have like a hallway search. I think I will. Just an apartment because the top floor has a roof. Yes, yeah. Yeah, I think it's just like a, a double floor, um, like a two floor apartment, I guess, isn't it? Um, okay. Right, I think we are going to make this quite like open plan. What I'm going to quickly do is let's just get some lights in. Downstairs will be the kitchen, like dining, living room area. I think maybe I will do like a half bathroom down here. So just like a toilet and sink kind of sitch, which perhaps that can be... Hmm. I think so, Raven, yeah. The penthouse lots are like a normal lot on top of a building. 
Um, so this would be an apartment. Yeah. Let's do... Like that. Okay, let's get some lights. Some... Hello, Sealands. Welcome in. How are you doing today? Welcome, welcome. We are just building Thorn's next apartment um, that her and Emily have just moved into. So welcome in. Yeah, I don't play a lot in San Myshuno as well. But yeah, there's loads of like different apartments that you can kind of pick and choose from, which is really good. Do that. That's Thorn's room. Spare room, I guess. Oops. Yeah, so if they do have kiddos, um, we've got a lot of space here. This is looking to be quite a nice little apartment. Um, I will be watching this, the sim stream, probably. What time is it at? I won't be watching it on stream, I don't think. Depends what time it is. If it's in the next 10 minutes, then yeah. But I won't be watching it on stream if it's later. But I will be watching it. At 5. Hmm. I'll probably come off before then so I can record a video about it. Um, for YouTube. Betty Moon, welcome in. Ah, you're so cute, Shy. You don't need lights. You, you yourself, Shy, are super bright already. You light up any room. Oh, you cute head. I just want to bundle you up and keep you in a jar forever. <laughs> um, Zoe, that is troll behaviour. <laughs> Zoe, gifting volcanic activity a sub. Zoe wants me to put this lot challenge. <laughs> <laughs> this lot is near an active volcano. Beware of earthquakes, steam vents, and occasional lava bombs. <laughs> Thank you, Zoe, for the gift sub to volcanic activity. That is very kind of you, you little troll. Um, but can we get some hypes in chat for Zoe, you lot? Um, and Radville, welcome in. We are building Thorn's next apartment in My Sims in Bloom. I don't think that that's what it's for, Sarah. I think the uh, it's a behind the Sims summit, I believe which isn't, um, I don't, I don't think it's showcasing the new horse pack. Um, I thought it was probably going to be more information on, um, the Sims 5, essentially what they, what they were working on last time. Um, I'll have to write down these reminders and give them two in a jar next time I see you. Wait, that would be so cute. Stop. That is so cute. Little cute head. Um, oh wait, we're doing red themed, aren't we? Although the Doors can be whatever colour we want. What's on the back of this? Okay, I like this door. Let's do that one. And then we've got door to the bathroom. Yes, definitely Kiwi. Yeah, you can you can design any space. Do do whatever you want, right? Um what I think I'm gonna do is um, Let's do this. Um, we're gonna do it that way. Um wait, I'm wait, what what it what is the confusion? I I'm 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 confused now that everyone else is confused. What it what is the confusion? You're doing well, uh, so fun. I hope you're doing well, Taz. I'm doing good, thank you. Um, yeah, I'm doing okay. Better to be here building and chilling um, and just vibing, really. Let's see. Well, I don't know what... Um, I don't, this The fact that all the walls are blue is kind of throwing me off. So let me, like, just do this. Um to make that a little bit better. Yes, yeah. Yeah, because Thorn um, is moving into a new apartment. Uh, Primrose isn't living with them anymore. And their dog, yeah, that's true. <laughs> Don't forget, she'll have her hashtag golden retreat. How could I ever forget? There's no forgetting that. Huh? Yeah, Prim's moving out. So I started a new series, Mora, called um, In the Military. 
Um, but it's like I only record it on YouTube, so I don't like do it on stream. Um, and we're focusing more on Primrose uh, in that new series. Um, um, so that's, yeah, that's her series now. Because I thought, like, I don't want to... Um, because we chose the one as, yeah, I still wanted her to live with us for a bit. But I felt like now that they're married, like, now's the time for her to kind of move out. And then we can just focus on her on her series and whatnot. I really want to use custom content. Okay, don't use CC. Um, I don't have my Sims on the gallery. I've got them in my library, um, but I haven't put them on the gallery. This is an eerie looking... Oh, wait, I like this. Okay, it's kind of oldie worldy. Um, I kind of like that. I'm not sure if I am. I didn't upload her last apartment. What Sims in Bloom have I even uploaded? I don't think I've uploaded any. Did I upload? I haven't even uploaded Indies one because that one has CC in it. Hello, Nikki. It's good to see you. Um, I'm okay, thank you. How how have you been? It is good to see you. Yeah, that's true. I guess if we do upload it, then at least there's no CC. Hi, Captain. Hi, hi, hi. Enjoy your coffee. Um, yeah, and then if we don't, or, well, if we do upload it, then afterwards we can add the CC, I guess. Okay, we need to do red and black. We need to remember that Thorn's colours are red and black. Um, oh, thank you, Miss Marika. I need that. Oh, that's good. Well, I guess it's good. Is it good that you've been busy? Is it like a, is it a good kind of busy? I hope so. Okay, I think if we do that and then... Maybe... Where's the um, bricky thing? I see it all the time and now I'm like, oh, here. Okay, wait a minute. This one's only a half bath, isn't it? I'm going to start with the bathroom. I never start with the bathroom. So don't ask me why. Oh, there's Primrose's medal display case. Okay. Yeah, don't ask me why I'm starting with the bathroom, but we are today. Lucy, welcome in. How are you doing today? And Libby, welcome in there. A good kind of busy. Oh, that's so exciting. That is so exciting. When when are you due, Nikki? If you I mean don't obviously say if you don't want to say, but that's so exciting. Congratulations. That's awesome. Aw. Okay, we've got 37 grand to work with here. So let's just um we we don't need to be too stingy. Uh, got so much CC in my game. It takes literally 10 minutes to start up. The first time I start it, oh no. I'm not even going to say what I always say because it's it's like I'm a broken record now. I know that I need to sort through my TG, but I never do. Oh, congratulations. That's exciting. Not too long away either. September's a great month. I do like September. It is a good month, but May is my favourite month. And also June. Okay, I want... Let's do that. No one has time to sort out their CC, just get more. Literally, this is me. Like, acknowledging the fact that I know I need to, like, sort through my CC and then ultimately just ending up getting more and making it even worse. It's like a never-ending cycle. It is dangerous. Real dangerous. Don't talk to me about CC. <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, it's it's not good. It is not good. Can we put a little candle on here, actually? I have a candle on the top of my toilet. Not on the toilet itself, but like there. I've got an ivy plant dangling down off of the um, toilet seat and then like a candle there. Kind of like that. Not that I'm replicating my own apart, like <laughs> my uh, uh, my own house, but I just thought I would. 
my poor game. It's coming quick um, and fast, and September's already a busy month for me. So I thought I'd um, I'd add another. Gosh, a lot is going on for you then over the upcoming months. Um, welcome in HG. It is an apartment for Thorn and Emily. It is indeed. Do that. Hello, Lefty. Welcome in. We've only been live for half an hour. Um, I always, at the minute now, start later um, on Tuesdays. Um, so I did actually pop a little announcement on my Discord. So if anybody is not in my Discord and does want to join, um, you can do exclamation point Discord. Um, but yeah, just an, a little announcement saying that streams on Tuesdays are going to start a little bit later. I have started therapy, um, which I'm like finding to be really helpful at the minute. Um, and yeah, it just, I the timing of it, um, correlates with the stream, which means stream has to be pushed back to be a little bit later. So yeah, that's where that's where we're at. We're dumping everything in a fit of madness and then crying over missing it and not finding the one CC. That's what I did. I deleted a load of like furniture CC and then I, and then I couldn't find something that I really wanted and then had to download it all back. Sad times. Um. I kind of want a little shelving thing above this. Um, um, I haven't deleted my CC, but I've removed it and just sort of forgotten to start putting it back in. Don't want to put myself through the sorting of taking out the broken bits. Yeah. Yeah, it is. It is tough. I know I've got a fair few broken bits of CC as well. Oh, dear. One day. One day I'll do it. Ah, uh, thank you, Lefty. Yeah, I just popped a little announcement on Discord so um, people can check that and sort of realise that um, we're kind of in an, a bit of a new streaming schedule, figuring out what sort of works, you know? Ah, uh, yeah, they were so cute. So um, Bonnie, my brother's dog, met Lexi and Evie um, the other day. Last week it was, I think. Um, and yeah, Lexi, uh, Evie and Bonnie were great, like, but Lexi is, um, she's not that great with other dogs. So at first she wasn't that keen on Bonnie, but eventually, eventually she warmed to her and was fine. And they tolerated each other. Got double sets of some CC in your game? Really, Sha? Oh no. That's the thing. And then you've got to figure out which bits are double and whatnot. Oh dear. Um, pop an electric razor up here. And then let's do this bathroom tray as well. You had so much build by CC that you never used. It was taking up unnecessary space. Yeah, I feel like I try not to use too much build by CC. The main thing that I do use in terms of build by CC is actually, um, what's it called? The trash bin, the CC money bin. That's what I put in my builds nowadays, really. Remind me to do it whenever I come visit you next, because you probably won't do it until then. This is true. This is very true, unfortunately. <laughs> I just, yeah, I'm lazy. Oh, I just don't have time, in all honesty. Dragon! That is a brand new sub! Can we please hype up the chat for Dragonfire there? Thank you so, so much for that brand new sub to the channel! Huge hypes for Dragonfire, everybody. Thank you so, so much for supporting in that way. Thank you for choosing to subscribe, um, but also just hanging out. I hope you enjoy being a sub here um, and enjoy using all of the emotes and everything. Thank you, thank you for that. Big, big hypes and loves in chat for Dragonfire. Um, and then Saffron, thank you. Uh, welcome on in. How are you doing today? Um, and Sue Fandom, thank you for that follow. Welcome in. Um, I hope you're having a good Tuesday. Welcome, welcome. Uh, thank you for hyping. Thank you, thank you. Um, I use the original money bin, hiding it in the kitchen counter to look like a cutting board. I've seen that hack before, yeah. That is a good trick. Did you, Shaw? I think it was like, I can't even remember. I think somebody in the community, whether it was Dan or somebody, um, linked that to me. Because I was like, I like the money bin, but it's it's boring. 
It's not something fun to do. That's why you're putting it off. Yeah, literally. Constantly putting it off. Okay, what is a social media star going to have in their bathroom as a painting? Oh, thank you again, Dragonfire. Let's do this in small. Mm -hmm. um, I use either the Little Dika money trash can or the rainbow recolor I have. Oh, welcome in, Rubber. I love Little Dika. They're a good egg. Cozy Chili, welcome in. Welcome, welcome. Oh, dear Lucy. Yeah, poses are hard not to get, though. I've got a fair few in-game poses and cast poses as well. It's an addiction at this point. It really is. Um, okay. Okay, red and black. I need to need to stick with this. I know what it's gonna be. Uh let's do an arch and yeah, that's what I do need. Pet poses. That is very true. I always forget though. Oh, could do some this sort of vibes. Um do 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 Mm, don't love it. Nah. Um, this makes me miss The Sims so much, but my PC hates all the CC. Oh no, Nikki. I was just thinking like, I need to get a new PC because mine is like, <laughs> mine's not doing so well with all the, all the CC that I've got, seriously. Um, what, what don't you understand, Captain? So cast ones, um, they are assigned to like a certain trait. And then when you click them, the character, like the sim will do that pose kind of thing. Um, and then in game ones, you click on the sim and like you select like pose by pack. And then they um, will do the pose basically, whichever one you click. Cat Zap, welcome in. Oh, yes, please, Shah. Dogs poses. Yeah, that would be great if you don't mind. Uh, I have no idea, Captain. I think somebody linked that in my CC links on Discord. The puppy training pad. I have no idea. A simster. So use poses to tell stories. Yeah, that makes sense. They're good for that. Um, What do I want to do? Hmm... Um, Okay, let me filter by black and red. Yeah, I mainly use poses for thumbnails. Um, that's like my my main use for them. For YouTube and that. Hello, Sinead. How are you doing? Welcome in. Welcome, welcome. Um. Okay, that's kind of nifty. What if we do a little something, something like that? And then, let's see. I don't want to do a brick, but no, not going to work. Um, I'm going to change the color of the stairs. That's fine. Um, I think the puppy training pad was linked by Dan, but could have only been in mod chat. Oh, maybe. If I find it, I'll post in CC links. Thank you, Claire. Shio, welcome in. How are you doing today? Welcome, welcome. Happy Tuesday. And Aqua, welcome in there as well. Hello, hello. Yeah, a lot of the mods that I have, nine times out of ten, are like linked to me by <laughs> either community members or by my mods, basically, by, by Dan and that. Um, okay, this is an apartment for a social media influencer. What are we going to do? Yeah, the puppy pad is a lifesaver. Morning Waffles, welcome in. How are you doing? Welcome, welcome. Maybe it is Ravishine. Yeah, I think you're right. Okay. 
Okay, let's do... Very garish, but it is rose gin, so it's got to be red and black. Um, okay. Kitchen. Let's do... Let's do kitchen here, actually. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, Dragonfire, thank you for that gift sub over to Arista Girl there. Can we please get some hypes in chat for Dragonfire? Um, if you've got the hype, spam the hype or do exclamation point hype. Thank you so, so much, Dragon. That is super duper kind of you. Um, and I really, really appreciate it. If you've got the hype, get them in chat. Thank you. You never have to be doing anything, um, let alone gifting subs or subscribing yourself. But thank you for that. Um, been good. My sister had um, a wedding on Sunday, um, so been busy. Today's a little bit uh, of an easygoing day, though. That's nice. Congratulations to your sister. Um, that's that's fantastic. And Julia, hello, welcome on in. Thank you for lurking. And Daisy Chains, welcome in there as well. Um, I'm at my car, so I have to drive home. Love you with all my heart, and always remember that no matter what happens, I'll always be here waiting and cheering you on. Thank you, Shah. I love you too. And drive safe. Please do drive safe. Um, I'm glad you're all finished up now and can go home and rest and relax um, and look after yourself. We love you. Happy Tuesday, Frilly. Welcome in. Um, and Squidgy, hello. Welcome in. How are you doing, my love? Um, ah, Nikki, you little cute head. I um, haven't really, I don't really build a lot anymore, Nikki. I um, kind of like got a lot more into gameplay. So, because there was obviously a time where I was like building obsessively. Um, and that was kind of like the only thing that I really did on stream. So it is like, it is hard going back to it because I just don't feel as confident in my builds as I might have used to. Um, but it's fine. It's, it's, it's fine. We're, we're getting there. Um, but yeah, thank you. Little cute head. Um, I think we... I don't think there's a matching thing for that, is there? Can we... That's not even gonna... See... I might just do that. And then let's do the fridge here. What's the time? I might take a quick break, actually, in just a second. We will do that there. And then that is going to be where the oven is. Like that. And then I think... I kind of want to do a dining room table here. And then, like, area for chilling, watching TV and whatnot here. Also, I want to make this, like, a... Nice little walk-in space. Could we make this black? Yeah, that's probably going to be best, isn't it? If we change all the doors to be black. Since that is the theme of it. Uh, let's do that. Perfect. Um, okay. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take a brick... A, a brick? <laughs> a quick break... Um, I'll pop you lot on words on stream. Let me get that up. Um, and yeah, I will be right back. I'm just going to go check on the doggies downstairs. Um, and I might get a little snack as well. And then we can come up and carry on building. They're doing okay, Squidgy. They're doing okay. Um, Bonnie was up barking until midnight last night, <laughs> which was, um, yeah, I'm shattered today. But yeah, they're doing all right. Um, when I joined the channel, you used to say you'd never do gameplay. Yeah, that's right, Raven. Especially the 100 baby challenge, how times have changed. Thank you for that, Luxie Lambs. A brick and a break. Good combo. Thank you, Reese. Welcome in, by the way, love. And thank you, Nikki. Um, I will be right back, my loves. I'm just going to pop this on for you. Um, take a break yourselves if you need, and I'll be back in a few.
Hello, everybody. I am back. I'll let you lot finish this round and then we will um, jump back into building. Thank you, Reese. Thanks, Claire. Thank you, Emma and Nikki. I'm just thinking, maybe we will react to this announcement on stream because I could still cut it up and edit it for YouTube and just post it tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think that's what I might do. Because Alex is coming home um, after work. He doesn't have gym or training or anything. So he won't be back until like probably half five. And the I think the video is only like 15 minutes long or something. So we've got time. Okay, top five. We've got Tibble number one, Sarah number two, Ketzap number three, Sandy's number four, Frilou number five, and Sam just missing out in number six. Good morning, Bella. How are you doing? Welcome in, love. Welcome, welcome. Um, okay, we will jump back into our little building here. We are working on Thorn and Emily's new apartment since they have now moved out of the original one um, that they were living in with Primrose. They've moved out of that and now they're living on their own for the first time ever because Primrose was always there. So it is now time for them to get a taste of life on their own. Can we change that to be black, I think? Um, um, I'm okay. Thank you for asking, Bianca. What about yourself? Um, I hope that you're doing good. Thank you for coming on in. Um, I'm okay. I'm okay. Um, I'm glad you're good, Bella. I'm glad to hear that always. Um, actually, while I've got this open, let me just pop this in. What was going to be her room? This one. This is Thorn's room. So let's just pop these bits in here. Um, and her microphone. Okay. I'll sort that out later. Um, yeah, so we're just working on a little apartment. I want to make this as like more cluttered than the last one. Because I think, like, obviously, when we were first, um, when we first moved into the last or the first apartment, we didn't have enough money to like clutter it up like we wanted. Um, whereas now we've got like a decent amount, so we can clutter it and um, add to it, and still hopefully be able to kind of clutter up and design the whole house. So let's just see how we get on. Um, we can grab a fruit bowl. Where are we? Where are we? Also a utensil holder. Perfect. Um, let's see, fruit bowl. There we go. And um, let's see what else. Actually, let's switch over to him and get some bits and bobs. Hmm. Speaking of fruit bowls, did you have one today? I know Alex usually makes you one. Yes, he um, he made it um, this morning. So I had it for breakfast. I've been having my fruit every morning, which is like really good. Because honestly, like there's no way I would personally just go and cut up some fruit and eat it. So very handy to have him doing that for me. But yeah, he's been doing that literally every morning. He'll go to work and he'll leave me a little fruit bowl. Neither would I. The uh... thing is, I, I like enjoy fruit and everything, but it's just effort, isn't it? To like cut it up and whatnot. I need Alex to make me fruit bowls too. He would. <laughs> he would. Yeah, it is tasty. He is so cute. He is a good egg. Let's see. Do that. And then some more 
bits and bobs. Maybe like this little pot set thing. It feels weird to be building again. It's the effort. I don't have the energy or drive to do it. I'm the same. Literally the exact same. But like when it's literally done for me, I will eat it. But I just won't bring myself to, to do it. Mm -hmm. Who does? Yeah, that's true. I like smoothies though. We got that smoothie, um, you lot got that smoothie maker and uh, that's tasty. Like having, putting that in. But then again, it's like effort. <laughs> effort to put it all in and make a smoothie. Um, Comrade Edgar, welcome in. Hopefully we can, we can be a bit of a positive distraction for you. Welcome, welcome. Um, I hope everything's okay. You go to your mum's for fruit so she can cut it for you. That is a good hack. That is real good. Although even when I was living with my parents, oh, I love that. Um, yeah, even when I was living with my parents, like sometimes mum would like bring me up the occasional like bowl of um, like, um, what was it? Honeydew melon and stuff like that. But like that wouldn't be every day. Alex like make sure, make sure I have it every day. It's great. Red fire, welcome on in. Welcome, welcome. You can buy pre-made smoothie packs, like full of uh, sliced fruits and put it all in the smoothie maker and it's super easy. Wait, I didn't even know you could do that. That is a hack and a half, Emma. I do love a smoothie. Um, enjoy your cup of tea, Dragon. If I could eat honeydew uh, and watermelon every day fresh, I would be the happiest person ever. Yeah, watermelon's good too. I think I prefer honeydew melon though, but they're still really good. Yeah, is, is it quite expensive, Emma? Like, say if you were to do that every day. Bags of frozen fruit. I don't have enough spe freezer space for frozen fruit. I can hardly fit a pizza in there. <laughs> um, my store's had those bags for years, close to the other frozen fruits. Um, thundering really bad in the States. Oh, the poor puppy. Oh, I hope it's okay. You love cutting up fruit, but you don't like it. Yeah, I do, I do, I do enjoy fruit. But yeah, it's one of those things like frozen fruit. I, um, I just don't have the space for. Yeah, Tesco, actually Sainsbury's is probably closer, but, uh, Tesco's one of the closest shops to us. Okay, can we do like a coffee machine or something? Not a fan of frozen fruit unless I'm putting it in a drink. Um, yeah, I've never had frozen fruit. We've always kind of got it, got it fresh. But I've never tried it, so I can't really say, say too much. Actually, do you know, I might do this. I'm sleeping. Um, and then coffee. Yeah, we have a club card. It is great. So handy. Fresh is always better, yeah. We have frozen grapes, but only because I think Alex... <laughs> Alex read somewhere that, like, adding grapes into, like, wine and stuff, like, frozen grapes into wine is, like, it just is a, is a fun thing to do. So there's just these random frozen grapes in our fridge that I think have been there for like six months. And have we added it to wine? No. That is disgusting, Emma. Absolutely disgusting. I do not approve. <laughs> do not approve of this behaviour. I like frozen strawberries, but uh, some other fruit doesn't freeze very well, in my opinion. Oh, bless her. Poor baby. Supposed to keep your wine cold, but not water it down. Yeah, that's what it is. That's what it is. Frozen grapes act as ice cubes without watering down the wine. That's why. Yeah, I remember he did it for a reason. But we, like I said, we haven't used it. So <laughs> it's just still there hanging out in the freezer, taking up valuable freezer space. Um, I love that, but it's CC. CC. You can always buy fruit that doesn't need to be peeled, just washed like berries. We do. So the main fruits that I buy, um, the fruits that we buy and that are like pretty much in the fridge all the time is 
or in not in the fridge but everywhere we so bananas and apples are in the fruit bowl and then in the fridge we've got raspberries blueberries grapes and strawberries um so those are the main fridges fridges <laughs> the main fruits that we have um in the house at all times pretty much uh take care dragon i hope the doctor's appointment goes okay absolutely not bella i disagree i disagree with this behavior yeah yeah i think so claire i think so um right i want to do like we need a modern sofa mm, could do like oh what's this one oh that's cool wait is that with the book one i've never seen this so far that came with book thing imaging book vibes and all that oh no i love that but it's not red we could do that one okay this is too much uh oh we could do a black uh no a red rug um we need to like say um <laughs> at least i'm not one of those that think pineapple is a pizza topping uh, yeah shock him still shocking behavior to even eat such a thing um some of these are a little bit too garish that's the only thing oh let's do um Mum was saying there's a jelly powder you can get. Wash your grapes, sprinkle the powder on them, then stick them in the freezer. And she said they're lovely. Okay. Greek yogurt, that's fair. Greek yogurt's tasty. Um, I just like fresh cut pineapple, even though my mouth breaks out in sores after I eat it. Really, Bella? Is, do you not think that that's a sign to not eat it then? <laughs> Why are you still eating it after it's hurting you? Oh, thank you, Emma. Super cheap for loads of smoothie mixes. Maywell, welcome in. Happy Tuesday to you as well. Welcome, welcome. You had cheese and pineapple hedgehogs at parties. Zomnum, welcome in there. Um, get that emote out of here, Emma. That is an illegal emote in this chat. You know that. Very illegal. Um, let's do this table. Is this going to work? With that small gap? I don't know. Let's see. Hello, fruitish. Coming in with a pineapple. You can't do that. You can't come in with a pineapple and then lurk. That's not very, very friendly behaviour. <laughs> How are you, Mark? It's good to see you, my love. Don't worry. If you do want to lurk, you're very welcome to. But I am just calling you out for that behaviour. Because that is not very, very Taz Kabaz allowed. No, you're not an angel. Nope. Nopity nope. <laughs> um, you love pineapple? Okay, Nikki, can we, can we get a ban on Nikki if that's okay? <laughs> uh, slash ban miles of Nikki if, uh, if you need, need to know what, what the command is. Oranges do that to me too. I don't do it often, but sometimes I get a random craving for it. I have a numbing mouth wash that I'm supposed to use right after eating it. Oh my lord, Bella. They're going to burn your... If you keep eating pineapple and all that, it's going to burn your mouth off and you won't have a mouth and we won't be able to hear your wonderful voice. Mark is naughty. No, nope, pineapples aren't allowed here. Nope. Um, we're building for Sims in Bloom, an apartment for my Sims in Bloom series um, for them to move into at the minute. I don't care. Pineapple in itself is horrible and is banned here. I don't care whether it's pineapple on pizza. Oh, there you go. Mark's trying to get back into my good books. What are these chairs? They're random. Well, it worked, Mark. You got back in. <laughs> you, uh, you succeeded. Okay, let's do these chairs. Not normal for it to burn. Melons are your preferred fruit. When you watch SpongeBob, you're allowing pineapple in your life. Oh, funny. 
You can't help the cravings. I hope baby doesn't like pineapple, Nikki. That would be catastrophic. Not mad, just disappointed. Okay, let's do a little planties. Um, we could do Emily's desk down here for her, like, filing her court documents and whatnot. I think I am going to delete the PC that we did have, though. Wait a minute. Yeah, so, um, Zomnum, this, um, this is for my Sims and Bloom challenge. And basically, each gen um, has specific colours. So, Thorn's gen is red and black. Um, so, when I do the each thing, like, I design their houses based on their colours. So, last gen was lavender. So, his house was, like, all purple and whatnot, purple and lilac. Um, but this gen is red and black, so... Yeah, that's uh, that's what we're doing. Um, okay. Let's do that, and then let's get a little chair. Mm -mm -mm -mm. We could do... Oh, my God, we've only got 14 grand. Okay, I'm getting carried away here. Okay, what I'm going to do is let's make a start on the upstairs just so that we've got something down in each room. Yes, there you go. It is illegal. It is illegal behaviour. Indeed it is. Okay, black and red. Gosh, we need to keep an eye on timing here if the thingamajig starts at, at um, five. Is it on YouTube or is it on Twitch? Does anyone know? Wait, cotton candy grapes? That's interesting. Is there anything I can put on the wall? Hmm. Do like that there just to spice it up. Uh they're slightly bigger than regular grapes, but are so delicious. Cotton candy grapes are so good. I've never tried them. Coconut. I never buy them, but too much effort. But I love anything to do with coconuts. Yeah, you know, I don't know if I've ever actually like had coconut. I'm trying to think. I've had, like, coconut-flavoured things, but not, like, just coconut, you know? I don't think I have. Cotton candy grapes. And they're good. Used to get them from Tesco, but I'm sure other places do them. Maybe I'll have to have a little look for them next time I do a shop. I've never noticed them. Tasca Blaine, one, two, three. <laughs> Can we um, get some Tasca fingers in chat for um, fruitish term? Mark, thank you for the 100 bits. Um, but absolutely not. I get a Texas barbecue from Domino's Pizza. I will never, ever get a plain pizza with dough and extra pineapple. That is horrible. <laughs> Awful. Can you imagine? Like pizza dough with no cheese, no sauce, nothing, and just pineapple. Oh my god. I'm gonna have nightmares about that tonight. Literally gonna have nightmares. Oh, I love a bounty bar. I do like bounty. But yeah, like I will have I will have coconut flavoured things, but I just never have like pure coconut. Yeah, they would definitely be talking about it for weeks. I mean, I used to work at Domino's and we would talk about some weird orders. Someone once had like tuna and then anchovies and jalapenos all on one pizza. And I was like, uh, uh <laughs> what? <laughs> Absolutely gross behavior. It's just too much, this. Hmm. 
Mm. Sounds delicious. I'll send that one over to you, Mark. I've got, sorry, bear with me. I've got a gnat bite on my knee and it is itchy as anything. Itch, itch, itch. I woke up this morning and it was so itchy and now it's even more itchy. I need to put like witch hazel or something on it. Okay. Um... That is custom content. Don't itch, it makes it even more itchy. My friend ordered a make your own pizza once and I picked all the toppings, but forgot the cheese. Oh no, Emma. It's, it's so itchy. I went for grapes, came back with grapes, but also, oh, I want a mini eclair. That sounds delish. Mini eclair. Um, I don't know if it's an American thing, but I really like the Philly pizza they make. No sauce. It's a cheese only base at Domino's. Yeah, we definitely don't do that here. I think you can like ask for no sauce or whatever, but it's not like a custom pizza that you can like that is there that you can get kind of thing. Um, okay, I might just go for that. So this is Thorn and Emily's room. Oh, is it? I, do, I don't use vinegar, but I do have vinegar downstairs. Me and Alex don't eat it, but I use it for cleaning sometimes because vinegar is good for that. <laughs> um, come on over, Taz. I have two of them. Uh, you can have the other. Oh, thanks, Claire. I'd love that. Oh, yeah, they did do the hot dog stuff crust when I was there. Um, um, I don't think I ever tried it. Oh, Alex is already on his way home. Interesting. He might arrive like before I finish stream then. Oh my god, my leg's so itchy. Hello, Richie. Welcome in. It's good to see you. Welcome, welcome. Hello, hello. We do have in Italy weird pizza, thin pear slices with blue cheese and balsamic vinegar on a white base, no tomato sauce. Wait, pear? Hold a minute. Who is it? Who is it? And which country is it that puts banana on a pizza? Is that Sweden? Because I feel like I, I recall Mark talking about this before. Um, Captain, thank you for a demon world check. Um, feel free to share. Oh, look, Nims and Mark are already sharing their location. Um, oh, and Ve <laughs> No, I'm joking. I know they're saying Sweden is banana. But feel free to share where you are from in the world. Obviously, no exact locations. Um, we've got Yorkshire. We've got West Midlands. We have Wales. I'm from southeast of England. Um, but yeah, it is Sweden. With curry powder on a pizza. Is there sauce as well? We have North Yorkshire, um, banana peanuts and curry with chicken. I have no idea, Daisy. The flying Jacob. Who's Jacob and why is he flying? We've got Illinois, West Germany, Northeast England, Northeast Scotland, Glasgow, Scotland, East Sussex, England there as well. Wisconsin, USA, Sweden. Yeah, fish on a pizza. D don't get me wrong. Like, there's certain types of fish that I like. But you're just destroying a pizza. Southwest of England in Somerset. Emma wants a banana sandwich. Um, oh, my leg's so itchy. I don't even like anchovies altogether. Icky. Um... I feel like we need to, in the next Sims in Bloom episode, send Emily out on a money, money grabbing hunt again. Maybe they can go to different locations. I feel like... Mm, I feel like this is like weird vibes that they would want. No, maybe this is like weird bedside table vibes that, that they would like. It's a tomato base with mozzarella, smoked ham, Pineapple and banana with a little curry powder sprinkled on each banana. Pineapple. Flying Jacob is a Swedish casserole composed of chicken, cream, chili sauce, bananas, roasted peanuts and bacon, which they've also now put on pizza. Irish bit in New York. Take an antihistamine to reduce irritation. Apply cold compress. Hydrocortisone. Is that like witch hazel and stuff or germelina or whatever? 
banana pizza with curry powder and garlic sauce is quite good. Recommend at least trying it once. <laughs> Sounds like hell to me. I hate banana. You said something in your YouTube that I think is a British phase. I don't know what it is, but now I don't remember what it was. Was it about a Jeff? Um, wait, which video, Claire? Or some guy? I have no idea. Now I want to know. What have I said? You won't have banana. Magic cream. It works in so many cuts and scrapes, burns and stings. In a jiffy? No, I don't think I've ever said that in my life. Jemski, welcome in, my love. Yeah, I, I don't think I've ever said in a jiffy. I want to know what, I, what it was that I said, though. I do have random phrases. Yeah, I will be watching, watching the Sim stream. I will indeed. Uh, let's see. Um... I don't know what lamp I want to put on here. Banana flavour isn't there. It adds some soft mushiness to be the pizza. To the pizza, but the curry definitely is the biggest flavour. We do have Savlon. Maybe I'll have to put Savlon on it. Bubble trouble. From Boots. I'll have a look. We do have Savlon. That always works for things. Or Witch Hazel. Do you know, I couldn't find Witch Hazel for ages. Like, every place that I went into just had it sold out. Let's do... Let's pop a little thing at the end of the bed. Like an Ottoman. Alex might be working on uh, working from home on Thursday, and it's the first time like in ages that he's worked from home. I feel like you lot haven't seen him for yonks, so you might see him on Thursday stream. Really, Meg? You always have hydrocortisone cream at your house. Yeah, I don't, think, I don't know if we have that. I don't know if we have something that is, like, the equivalent of that. I have no idea. Um, let's get a dresser. Maybe we can make this, like, a walk-in closet. So let's do that. And then we'll do a little art try. Yeah, it's been it's been a while because he used to when he was doing his apprenticeship, um, he used to work from home like at least once a week. But he hasn't worked from home for a long, long time. So I did ask if he could get like a work from home day this week strictly because um, because having the dogs is like a lot. Um, to see if he could sort of help out with that. So I think he's going to see if he can get Thursday off. Oh, maybe. Yeah, I think I, I can't remember, Claire. I think I um, I got prescribed something for that. That was bad. Like when I was on holiday, I just had this massive rash everywhere like all up my leg like around mainly my ankle up my arms on my face everywhere um it was really really bad i don't know if it was like some form of heat rash or what but yeah i got that when i was in lake como came home went to the doctor and they were like oh my god this looks like basically my my feet were swollen as well and covered in this rash and the doctor literally said to me you your like your legs look like someone of like 80 years of age. And I was like, oh gosh. Yeah, I don't know if it was heat. I don't know what it was in all honesty. They didn't really say anything. I can't even remember. It was, 
a year ago now, but yeah, they prescribed something that like slowly worked, but it took weeks before it actually properly went. It took a long, long time. Let's see that one. Yeah, it was a strong one. Like, it did work. Like, it, it was fine. But it was one of those ones where you can only use them for a week. Otherwise, like, your skin... Like, it, it can be really bad for your skin. Or whatever it is. Like, they, I only had it... I could only use it for a week. Hmm. Hmm. Let's see. I might get some like shelving units in it. Actually, no, is there? No, where's the clothes that like hang down? Actually, it's in Dream Home Decorator, I think, isn't it? Yeah. It's five minutes. Oh, yeah. Okay, I think what we'll do is we'll finish up this build and maybe do it on, like, Thursday's stream and we can finish up the build then. Um, but I think for now we should go and get prepped for the Sims stream.